Hey guys, we're back with episode 3. Um, right now we're here in Villach um, and the upcoming days we will have our home World Cup. I'm really excited and uh, I hope that the crowd is as cool as at the Two Nights Tour. The new year started, but um, until now I'm really happy with the season. Constantly top 10 places. I mean, that's already pretty cool. Um, I had really no clue where I would be. Um, I mean, this season is completely different. It's just about finding back, um, yeah, going step by step. Last season I was of course, um, everything was easy and um, everything was going automatically. Um, after last season, it's a little bit harder. I mean, last season was pretty tough and um, I did not really enjoy being at the hill. And so this season is all about yeah, <laughs> having fun and enjoying being at the hill and just do ski jumping why I started it, um, just because I love it. Um, because it's fun, because far jumps are fun. Um, I mean, that's the main goal of the season. And that I'm already back in the top 10 is, of course, a huge step. Um, the preparation this season was also a little bit different. Um, the seasons before, I, I trained a lot. Yeah, after the overall World Cup win, I just told myself I have to train more and more and more. And um, yeah, just if you train more, you can get better. Uh, it turned out the wrong way, I guess. Um, that's something I learned from last season. Yeah, this summer it was most important to learn to switch off from ski jumping, to switch off from training, to know when, yeah, when I can train a lot and to know when I can't train a lot. Um, I have an amazing team. I mean, they they slow me down when needed and I think that's pretty cool because sometimes you're just um, so focused and so in your own okay I want to get better but sometimes you need to slow down so yeah they're really important and they are um, going with me on this journey um, and this season is I guess a season about learning learning um, which things work out which things don't work out So this season the challenge, the biggest challenges were probably the second day after the first day um, when I recognized that the first day is going really well then on the second day I, yeah I don't know, I catch myself up in getting already too excited about making those bigger steps and um, I don't know, in ski jumping you feel when you're getting closer but you can't force the things um, you have to let them be, I guess, and <laughs> things will come when they want to come. And yeah, um, I think that's, that's the most challenging thing to don't force the things. Just let them be, uh, accept the mi mistakes I'm doing. And yeah, then I think that I'm going step by step and coming closer to, to being in the top five and the top three again. Right now we are coming back from the Two Nights Tour. Uh, it was a pretty cool event, I would say. And we were at two hills where the men jump. And um, I don't know, we had a little bit that taste of the Vier Schanzen Tournee. Um, and I think that would be something really cool. There were so many people and I don't know, but in women's ski jumping, we don't have that big crowds, I would say. And yeah, it was really cool. I hope um, that we will have a few chances today in the future. Um, I guess it's possible. So um, yeah, let's see. Yeah, and right now we're here in Fila. Um, it's a small hill again after two big hills. And that's always a little bit of a change. The hill is pretty cool. And I hope that the crowd will be as cool as um, at the Two Nights Tour. <laughs> Yeah, and after Fila we are heading to Japan and um, yeah, I mean from now on there are no breaks anymore so it's really weekend after weekend, competition, competition and 
But I'm really looking forward to Japan. It's a great place. It's the place where I had my first win. Um, big emotions were there. Um, you have from out of nowhere to winning. So it's always a great place to come back. Um, always when we get to Sapporo, I'm in front of this hill and or on top of the hill. And I'm, yeah, I have this flashback about my first win. So that's pretty cool. And that's where the journey started, I would say. And yeah, after that, of course, the World War Tour, um, Hinzenbach, uh, second home World Cup, and ski flying will be a big thing, I guess. Last season I missed ski flying. Yeah, I'm just really excited. And I don't know, it just shows that women's ski jumping really grown over the past few years. Um, we have a lot of competitions, a lot of competitions on big hills. And yeah, that makes me proud and um, it's cool and I hope that it continues like this.